Hello guys, again this time the video will a little bit uh, be about YouTubing and equipment you need. And we all know usually we have this small handheld tripod selfie sticks you can extend and take a video. This one is the Mosa Nano SE and this one is nice because this axis is stabilized so in case I move the gimbal around this one stays stabilized and this is quite really good when filming outside combined with the stabilization from the camera. Unfortunately this selfie stick is short it's not even a little longer than my arm and the problem is it only has this small stand here so especially if I put it on the table and it's extended like this it likely wants to tip over if a hard strong uh, camera is installed a cell phone because the weight on top is way too much so the thing is we need to find a way to get this yeah, better stabilized and what I always liked was to have a good tripod so last year I think I bought me this one on Lazada it's from Yunteng I think and this one really can extend a lot it's a little tricky sometimes and you should open the screw so this one as you can see has a much wider base to stand and it's stabilized much better that way and also it can extend much much longer yeah, if I, I can show you so this one really is uh, one meter 60 high yeah so you see this one if I put it now on the ground you see the tip the top is still Ooh, very high so nearly one meter seventy and so this is a great yeah, tripod but if I close it down yeah, you see I can easily use this as a selfie stick too and I have it very long the only problem with this one was that the tip where you mount everything comes off very easy because this plastic here is really short and it will of course get loose over time so what to do my idea now was when I checked the size of my gimbal stick and the size of this that they are nearly identical so my idea now is I cut off this one and insert it here because all the electronic is in the head here is the charging for the batteries the battery is included here and this is just the stand and honestly I don't need this I can even use the remote of this because this thing also here is detachable and that way I will see that I can get this inserted so you see even from the length it's much much better than this small one here like before and that way I get a tripod with a selfie stick and a one axis gimbal together mm. so I show you how it will look after the shortcut so now I cut it off you will screen but the Nomosa Nano SE is about 1200 peso online so it's not real a loss now with this cut it off first I thought because it's always also feeling a little simple I thought this is uh, plastic only but it turns out it seems to be aluminium like this one this is quite good because I thought this one is aluminium and I cannot really put a screw from steel in because welding aluminium and steel is <laughs> tricky very tricky so I think if you ask a welder if he can weld you a steel uh, screw inside then he will say sure I do but it will not be good um, I thought if this is plastic and I put it in maybe it will bend over time and gets loose now I see it's aluminium so now I know I can put this inside and if it gets loose I find me some yeah, aluminium glue to get it fixed and now let's see if it fits of course it will not because it has the same size 
So now I need to yeah, bend this a little bit with here yeah, to make it a little bit smaller, force it in, and then maybe I drill some smaller holes, one, two, three, to keep it in place. But that way it will be on top and I have a stabilized gimbal. Let's see how this works out. Yeah, in fact, it's a little more complicated than I think because I need to bend this down and this needs a little more time. But I also found this little aluminum tube here. This is hollow and it fits over this part. Uh, it's all wet. So I can put this inside here and it really neatly fits in like this. And then I can put this on here. It worked last second. So like this. And then I can put some screws so that it will not turn but hold. And that way I now have a... Okay, <laughs> it will turn down. But as you can see now I have a selfie stick and it still works. You can see at the battery and this will be done. So it's just a little fixing this. And the good thing is um, with this I now have a good selfie stick. This one is foldable so I can retract it and it is not too long. I can hold it like this. The part for the remote control I don't see at the moment. I can mount here because this is quite a good space here. This part to mount additional accessories. So I will use this to mount the remote control for the stick and maybe I put a holder here so that I can attach a power bank and then with a long cable I can charge the gimbal while I'm filming and even the cell phone while it's there. And of course my uh, the remote uh, wireless microphone. So this way now gives me more stability because of the long stand it's short enough to be used like a, a selfie stick and I have more flexibility, flexibility in the long run for going out and doing YouTube because this I still can take to any mall and it will be easy for me uh, to do my video things. It also looks a bit more impressive than a simple selfie stick or just a cell phone. And this is good if you are a blogger because people get interested in you. Are you a blogger? Are you a blogger? So I get more attention for my channel, more viewers like this. So with improving your gear, even you just use what you have and make stuff yourself, you get better results on YouTube in the long run. Okay, for now it's okay. I will show you the next days when I fix this. I still have to put it together and then you will see it in my next coming videos, hopefully already next week. Bye bye.